what is the conversion period in the organic we are going to discuss on this or in the reverse manner how much time required to convert conventional land into organic land and what are the rules regulations for this conversion period as per the different organic standards so we are going to discuss in detail about the conversion period in this video first thing why this conversion period is needed suppose we are doing the conventional farming on particular land for say 10 years 20 years 50 years or maybe 2 3 years in all these cases this conventional land cannot be converted into organic land in one day or in few weeks it takes some period to convert this conventional land into organic land and that period of conversion is called conversion period period of trans transforming conventional land into organic land is called conversion period but roughly as per the different organic standards it is from 2 to 3 years in some crop it is a 2 years for some crop it is a 3 years but from the first day you can get the organic certification which will be mentioned that this is the c1 certificate means c1 stand for conversion year 1 then you will get the c2 certificate for conversion year second and on the completion of the 3 years you will get the complete organic certificate this is the standard process about the certification during the conversion period see why this conversion period is needed when you are using the different chemicals fertilizer chemical pesticides and not following the organic practices then your land may have the residue of all these chemicals for and it will take some time to re remove the all these residues completely and second thing um, as soon as you stop using the chemical it will take time to regenerate the soil regenerate the microorganism to set up the ecosystem of the soils which will itself with the help of some organic fertilizer will do the nitrogen fixation will do the solubility of the phosphorus which is already exist in the soil so this microorganism system set up and to make your soil live to make your soil alive to make your soil functioning to develop the microorganism in the soil it takes some time it say takes some period that is called conversion period and as per the all organic standards you require the conversion period to convert the conventional land into organic land but if you are doing the farming on virgin land what is virgin land means you are uh, going to start the farming organic farming on the land which is not used for the farming before or which is not the conventional land which is the purely virgin land no one added any fertilizer there no farming has happened previously there then uh, for that land conversion period will be the zero yes for such a land for such a virgin land you can get the organic certification from the first day of the your farming now what will be the market for the land which is under conversion period yes many uh, farmers want to ask these questions if two years we are not completely organic then what will be the demand for our product see in the market there is always shortage or uh, shortage of the organic product there is always demand for the organic product in such cases what is c1 certificate stand in the market means you are not adding any chemical fertilizers you are not adding any chemical pesticides you are following the organic practices just your soil may have residue from the previously uh, conventional farming and that residue may or may not come in your the final product most of the uh, cases in the most of the cases i have seen that there is no any chemical residue 
in uh, uh, harvest of the C1 or C2 crops because that residue may be in the land, but it becomes very negligible or approximately zero to in the your produce. So C1 certificate product also have the market demand that you have not added any chemical intentionally, but there may be the some residue, negligible residue in your crop. So there is a demand and even the better price than conventional crop for the C1 certificate also. So never hesitate to go for the organic just due to the conversion period. In the first year C1 certification also, conversion period one certification also, you can get the good price and C2 you will get good price and after the completion of the three years, after completion of the conventional period which is defined by the your certification body, then you will be the complete organic and there will be the big demand for your uh, product as organic certified. So uh, don't hesitate to follow the conversion period rule and uh, you will get the good market in that period also. Then who decide this length of the conversion period means in, in general it is a two or three years uh, but who decide this? CB, the certification body and the standards followed by them has the right to define this uh, conversion period for this particular land or that particular farm. So first you submit your document to the certification body. They will review it and they will understand from how long you are doing the cropping, which practices you were following, whether you were following other standards such as biodynamic or any forest farming or your land is the conventional land or virgin land, according to that, they will fix the conversion period and they will issue the certificate to you C1, C2 or maybe the organic if you are doing on the virgin land. So this way, this all about the conversion period for the organic farming to convert the conventional farm into organic farm and hope this is clear about the conversion period. If you have any questions regarding conversion period, certification or anything in the organic, any business model of the organic, then you are free to contact me through the Soil to Body channel or our website www.soiltobody.com and you are free to ask your questions there and we will definitely answer you as per our knowledge, as per our experience and thank you. Keep sharing such a information to other farmers, other students so they can get benefited by this information. Thank you and all the best for the all organic activity you are doing or you are, you are planned to do it. Thank you.